hi all um, I'm doing a little bit of a different kind of video um, basically um, some people have asked me about you know when you're mining on Genesis mining about all the other kind of coins that you can that you can mine with so I decided well you know maybe I'll just basically buy a mega hash and then I'll just set it up to run so that it just mines a, a set coin every day um, so I've got it up and running to run um, black coin so what I've done is I've had it for a week now so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to bring up my black coin wallet and then we can go through the uh, the payouts that I've had in my black coin wallet um, first of all I'll just go to the transaction screen um, so I'll zoom into that a little bit so you can see a little bit better right then so anyway so what I've done is I basically will go through the payouts. I won't say the whole numbers, I'll just get, do the first like whole number and then a couple of decimal points, it'd be a lot easier. So my first payout on the 26th of September, um, which I, for that, that was for the mining day, um, was 0.57 black coins. Um, the following day it was 1.53 black coins. The day after that, 2.24 black coins and then it was 2.58 black coins, 2.32 black coins, 1.65 black coins and 1.45 black coins. Now what I'll also do is bring up my black coin wallet so you can just see obviously that the, uh, the you know that those coins did actually get to my wallet and everything was okay. So here you go. So here's all my transactions in my black coin wallet as well. Um, let's see. Um, let's go the other way around, maybe. Right, here you go. So there was the 1.45 and the 1.65, for example. Uh, I'll just go down to here. There's the 2.32 there, and then the next one should be 2.58. 2.58 there, and 2.58 there. I won't scroll down, but you kind of get the picture that obviously the coins go directly to your wallet. So all is well. Um, so then, as you can see, for that total, I got 12.365 black coins. Um, so what I then did is I went to an exchange and I exchanged them. Um, I'll just bring up the notepad anyway, now we can just go through some figures. Right, anyway, so there was my weekly total in black coins. And what I did is I went to an exchange called Bittrex. And what I did is I put all my um, that amount in, and I basically wanted to see how much Bitcoin I would get back if you know I sold at the current rate it was. So this is the figure I got back. So so if I'd have basically got my black coins and had sold them as uh, BTC, I would have got back 176,000. 137 satoshi well it doesn't really mean a lot does it really it does sound quite a large amount so what i've done is i so what i did was i got this amount of satoshi and i and i divided it by divided it by seven for the days in a week so you kind of get an average payout for the day so that came to 25,162 satoshis so basically in a way it's not so good as mining on auto BTC. Well, not for this particular week because you know some of you know that pools are very, you know, for example, with a mining pool one week or even with just one day, you have a really good payout, and then other days you get really low payouts. I mean, the Waffle Coin was a good example of that where one day I had quite a high payout and then it just goes back down again to quite low payouts. I mean, looking at this price 25,162 you kind of compare that for example with um, the Genesis mining and the Zen Hashlets for example and they're getting like the, the late you know they're getting around the 39,000 Satoshis up to about 44 45,000 Satoshis so right now it's probably better just to you know if you're using Genesis mining to basically just use the auto BTC um, and then if you want to buy black coins with that just transfer the, the black uh, your Bitcoin to an exchange and then just sell the bitcoin as black coins and then you'll probably get a higher return but but like anything what will probably happen is that there will be some days probably when i'm going to be uh getting payouts for black coin where where i'll be getting really good payouts so that was one reason i wanted to do this because i just wanted to see you know what would happen 
you know, every week, you know, will there be weeks where there'll be good payouts? I'm not actually going to do anything to black coins. I'm just going to basically save them uh, probably for future. Uh, so I might become a bag holder, so to speak. But, you know, I might not. But, you know, it doesn't really matter so much. Like I said, it was just a mega hash and it's just an experiment. And I just thought it'd be good because some of you guys that might be watching this video might have been interested in doing black coins. Um, the good thing is, though, is with this, you know, it does give you an idea. I do like doing things at one mega hash purely because it's very easy to calculate. For example, if you've got high amounts of hash rate, if, if I'd have done like 10 mega hash, for example, and you only had like 4 mega hash, then you've got to try and calculate a lot more. Whereas now, because I've said, well, you know, I've got 12.365 black coin this week, you know that if you had 10 mega hash, for example, you would have got about 123.6 black coins you know, give or take, and so it's very easy, you can just get the, uh, you can just take the total of every daily payment, you can take this 1.5 for example, and you can go, well if I had 3 mega hash, I would have had, and then you could just basically add times that by 3, or times that by 4, so it's a lot easier to work out when you're just working with 1 mega hash, so that's one re reason why I do everything in just one mega hash is because I think it's just easier to work out stuff. So anyway, I'll do another weekly go through with these next week. So this will be like a weekly video um, and then we can just have a look. But for this week, anyway, um, I would just do use auto BTC. <laughs> it's very hard though for me to say that, but you know, some of you, you know, it's the, the option is there. Um, you know, you never know, black, black coin might go up in price by two or three times in a few weeks time or in a few months time and then basically it will make it more profitable. But then but then, because the auto BTC option will probably be trading in black coins as well, then you'll probably see higher payouts on, on that too, I don't know. But anyway, it's an interesting experiment. Um, so for now, thanks for watching. Uh, please give me a comment about this, about this video, maybe you liked it or not liked it or subscribe as always um so yeah thanks for watching bye for now